Hi, it's Tessa, and I'm here today with an empties video, and I have a pink shirt on, which makes my hair look so red. I don't know why it looks so red today. The light coming in or something. I have wild hair today. Anyway, I'm messing with the angle of the camera because whatever. All right. I have a huge box of empties, and the reason it's gotten so big is because I broke my holder for my phone, so I could not film, but I can film now, and hopefully, I have to peek down at the thing, hopefully, um, I don't run out of time. Okay, on my phone memory. First thing I have is Bath & Body Works Black Cherry Marlowe Antibacterial Hand Soap. Um, this smelled really good. I had it for quite a while. I bought a bunch of them last year when they were on sale, and I've just been using them up. I have one more bottle, and I'll use the whole collection I had up. I have the Chic Quattro for women. I don't really like these razors, but I had a coupon, so I bought them. I have the Degree Clinical Protection Deodorant. Here's the box. Here's the deodorant. Um, I use that up. It's my favorite deodorant. I get it the Classic Romance scent, and I will continue to buy that again and again. I have a container of the Yardley Oatmeal and Almond Soap that I use to clean my makeup brushes with. I threw that, I threw that away. <laughs> I throw it in the sink and wash my brushes with it. Um, I have a video on how I clean my makeup brushes. This is the Pacifica Island Vanilla Natural Soap. I found this at TJ Maxx for $3.99. It's okay. It doesn't really lather that well. Um, the Crest Pro Health Toothpaste. I like this toothpaste. I alternate between toothpaste. Um, I just felt like getting this one the last time I went, so got that. Then I'm throwing these away because they're super old and I have not been using them. It's the Avon Shampoo and Conditioner. Uh, this is the Advanced Techniques 360 Nourish with Moroccan Argon Oil. I just don't like it, so I'm tossing it. And it's old, so I don't even want to give it to anybody else. I just kept having it around because I thought I'd use it, but I never did. I have several packages of my favorite um, makeup wipes, the Aveeno Ultra Calming Makeup Wipes. I have two. Love, love, love those. I used up a 100% pure organic coffee bean caffeinated eye cream. I love this eye cream, and I have since repurchased a bigger one. And the container for the bigger one looks like this. And then the tube comes in there. So I'm working on that now, which is going to last me a super long time, but I can't even get that back together. So yeah, I did buy one. Um, I finished up the Target Up and Up cotton rounds. I love these cotton rounds. I need to get some more. The Equate Non-Acetone Nail Polish Remover which is what I always use. I don't like the acetone, it dries out my fingers. I finished the Equate Beauty Makeup Cleansing Travel Wipes. I bought these when we were traveling, so I finished those up. What was it left? My favorite makeup remover is the Neutrogena Naturals. There's hair all over it. <laughs> Fresh Cleansing and Makeup Remover. I love this stuff, but I re will repurchase again and again because it's my favorite. I finished a Skin Tomate Travel Size Raspberry Rain um, Shave Gel. I used that when we were doing some traveling. This is the Sugared Vanilla Wish by Bath & Body Works. Finished that up. It smelled really good. Some of those might be limited edition from last year, so I don't even know if the scents are still available this year. I finished a Tresemme Luxury Luxurious Moisture shampoo when we were traveling and that's all gone. I finished a Crest 3D White Luxe Glamorous White Toothpaste. I really like this toothpaste. Why I didn't buy it again this past time? I don't know. And then I also finished up the Bumble and Bumble Thickening Shampoo and Conditioner. I wouldn't repurchase these. I just had them in a sample so I decided to Try them, they were okay, but I'm sure that they're an expensive shampoo and conditioner, and I won't pay the price for that. All right, everything else I have is makeup, which is shocking. I finished a while ago, almost all of it, before I realized it was causing me some problems. I love this foundation, and the fact that it makes me have some 
problems makes me mad because I want this to work for me. I love it. It's the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation. Yeah, my color was 810. I, oh, I love this foundation, but it just doesn't work. It makes me so upset. This is the um, Rimmel Stay Matte Light Ivory Foundation. I am tossing this horrible mess of a foundation out. It's disgusting. I finished a Revlon Color Stay Whipped Foundation in 220 Nude. That is my go-to foundation now. I love it. I finished out three mascaras. Um, my friend Deanna sent me this one, the Napoleon Perdice Mascara. She got this free with a magazine, I think. Um, it, it wasn't anything to write home about. So I'm glad she didn't actually purchase it. The, and then I finished out the Lorac Multiplex 3D Lash Mascara. This was in a set I got last Christmas. Um, it was all right. I wouldn't repurchase that. And this is the M. Michelle Fawn Mascara. I got this in a Ipsy bag around Christmas also last year. And um, it just, it was all right. I wouldn't buy it, but it got yucky, you know, old smells funny so but I used almost all of it up it was almost gone I used up two concealers the Maybelline instant age rewind dark circle eraser concealer and brightener and the Jane um, concealer in light which is my hands-down absolute favorite concealer of all time for under the eyes I <laughs> Deanna sent me this. This is a different packaging than the one we have here in the United States. This is a Baby Lips from Australia in Berry Crush. And I left it in my pocket. And I washed it. So it's gone. It, it's empty because I went out <laughs> in the laundry. And the last two things. This one is the Taupe Brow and Eyeliner by Wet n Wild. After you get down this far, it's like there's no product left in it. So that one's gone. And then this is the, I think, I can't really read it, but I think it was the L'Oreal Carbon Black Extra Something Liner. Um, there's not really any words I can read on it anymore, but it's gone too. That's everything for my empties, and thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Have a good day. Bye-bye.